Hello, this is Christine Halsey, and this is going to be part two of setting up your Raspberry Pi to work with the Adafruit LCD plate. Okay, so in this section, I want to edit a file called sorry, um, modules. Okay, so I updated my desktop in the last one, and in this one, I want to update, it's called backslash so pseudo space nano backspace backslash etc I'm sorry I said backslash it's forward slash modules and then you can see here I have the two lines I to C dash BCM 2708 and I2C dash DEV. Okay, then I do control O and enter and control X to exit. Now we want to turn off our Pi. So I'm going to click on the Raspberry up in the upper corner and shut down. Sorry about that. And then we click on shut down. Okay, so since I did a shutdown, I had to unplug and re-plug in the Raspberry Pi and let it reboot. Okay, and again, I'm going to open the LX terminal. And here I want to SUDO sudo space. R-A-S-P-I dash config. Okay, now here we want to go to interfacing options. Uh, I think our directions had said advanced options, but it's interfacing options. Another one you might want to use here if you're trying to connect to Wi-Fi is to set your clock using localization. All right, and then interfacing options is where we go and we're looking for I2C. And would you like the ARM I2C interface to be enabled? I'm going to hit yes. The ARM I2C interface is enabled. Okay. Now we use the arrow keys and scroll down and then over to finish. Now I'm going to again reboot my Pi, and then I'll come back with part three. 